We've already gotten the Horde Command Pack and some additional free content for Gears of War 3, but on December 13th we'll get the first story-driven add-on. It's not about Marcus Phoenix and the aftermath of Gears 3, but rather, it takes us back to a time before the original Gears of War and drops us into the chaos after Emergence Day. That means we're back to closing emergence holes with frag grenades and sleeping relatively soundly because the lambent threat doesn't show up for a few games. So without spoiling this prequel act to the Gears of War trilogy, what exactly is new? You start the experience as Zeta Squad, a team of cogs made up of Michael Barrick, Ty Kaliso, Min Young Kim, and the newcomer Alicia Valera. Zeta fights to evacuate citizens from the city of Alima before a krill storm hits. The cog's biggest new weapon is the Hammer of Dawn Command Center. Pulling back to a satellite-based black and white targeting system, this command center can completely obliterate any locusts that stand in the team's way, especially Reavers. But it's General Rom that marks the biggest change in this DLC. Starting in Chapter 2 of this 5-chapter pack, players get to take control of the steamroller as he tears up cog soldiers with a blast of krill. He can also charge using his powerful blade and decapitate anyone unlucky enough to get in the way. His plan is to ink out the sky using cedars so that the Krill Storm can take over. Does he succeed? Find out for yourself when Rom's Shadow hits Xbox Live on December 13th for 1200 Microsoft points. For more on Gears of War 3, check out IGN.com.